Finding cool stuff to do on the water is pretty easy these days. You can hydrofoil, you can wake surf, play basketball. Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We wanted to be able to do dunks off the dock, so we were trying to float the hoop in the water at first, and um, we had to kind of engineer the bottom of it with a broken board to let it float, um, but it didn't work at first. Mitch Flippo, Ben Lathwell, and Dane Mui spend as much time as they can on Lake Sammamish, and that's when the creative juices start flowing. The idea of surfing a basketball goal is fun. Engineering this feat took some work. It actually took us three weeks to actually get it going. We duct taped this broken inland surfer underneath backwards um, to cover the holes on the bottom of the hoop. We took that guy and put it right there to give it more balance um, while we actually surfed. It was a group effort trying to get that board up, but man, it was, it was something. But once we got up, it was, it was awesome. Yeah, there's definitely kind of an adrenaline rush that pushes you to do some certain things, but I don't think there was, any, there was ever a time that I really felt scared that I was going to get hurt. It didn't take long for this trick shot trio to collect over a million views worldwide, aided by an appearance on ESPN. Funny thing is, we made this for TikTok to try to get famous on TikTok. I know it sounds kind of funny to do, but we're like, okay, whatever. I go home, and then Mitch calls me. He's like, bro, we're at like 20,000 likes, and we're getting 10,000 every second. I'm like, no way. Of the three of them, Dane is the only one with basketball experience from his playing days at Issaquah High School. That can be clutch when you need to get the shot before the sun goes down. I was very close to getting a through the leg stunk jumping off the boat. What's it going to take, man? Maybe some training. Get some, get some box jumps in, hit the squats maybe. <laughs> these three know, these days it doesn't take long to become old news. So they're constantly looking for another showstopper. We're actually thinking of surfing a stop sign. I see it working by you literally just replace the board with the stop sign. And so then you get, while you're surfing, you're just directly on the stop sign while this is still gliding through the water. So I mean, theoretically you're floating on a stop sign. As far as obeying that stop sign, forget it. These three have no plans of pumping the brakes anytime soon.